Hello my friends, so today we have a lot of stuff to talk about. Today is a pretty good day for us Block Suits fans because there's a lot of stuff related to the update that we have seen or will be seeing in today's video. Alright, so we are going to be doing a permanent boot giveaway at 85,000 subscribers. But in the meantime, while we are waiting for that, I made sure to do a or I'm making sure to do a dark blade giveaway at 82,000 subscribers. And right now we are only 500 subscribers away from 82,000 subscribers. So if you want to, you know, get that dark blade giveaway started right now, all you have to do in order to be part of this is to like and subscribe to this video right now. And we're gonna do a ton of giveaways, so don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video with your friends. Subscribe now, okay? Oh, look what we have here. It's dragon fruit. Oh, but it's not the reworked version of dragon fruit. It's only the old, boring version of the dragon fruit. However, um, we got a new leak, so it's a pretty good day. That's what we're gonna talk about in today's video straight to the point aren't we so yeah we are very straight to the point in today's video because there's uh, some stuff to talk about and we're also gonna you know cover some other stuff as well um here is the latest leak that we saw um this is a leak of shafi where he was leaking a move so he's clearly leaking a move right now and you could even see some fire effects right here and i believe that this could be one of two things so as you guys can see right here in the very bottom he has dragon fruit equipped however um, yeah, he has dragon foot equipped right here, which is super cool. So this could be a dragon move, okay? However, apart from it being a dragon move, it could also be something else that I'm going to talk about, okay? So first and foremost, let's actually go take a look at the comment section right here. Because as you guys can see, Mag Magic Bus, which is a, uh, you know, pretty goaded comment. He said, if this is the inspiration, I'm now your biggest fan. And he basically showed um kings one one of king's attacks okay and as you guys can see right here if you stop it right here it's pretty much the exact same thing it's almost like an exact copy and this however is for lunarian race okay this is one of lunarian race's abilities if you go check the comments right here why would that be an inspiration they are doing dragon work and that ability is from king's lunarian race so so does that mean that we're gonna get Lunarian Race in the next update as well? Obviously not. This doesn't confirm anything. Um, the, the truth about this is Shafi probably just thought that this looked really cool and he decided to add it to the Dragon Fruit rework because, you know, he's the creator of Dragon Fruit rework. The effects, at the very least. He's not the modeler because the modeler, the modeler is Red Dopio. And for the effects, he holds that. And if he says that this looks good or if he thinks this looks good, then it's up to him to add it into the game. However... I just wanted to take note of that because I think that's a pretty cool catch by by myself and also by Magic Bus because he mentioned that it does look awfully similar to what King um, is doing here, which is actually very good. So if they are going to add Lunarian Race and make this the ability of Lunarian Race, because remember, you can have Dragon equipped and also use your Race ability. So um, maybe he has Dragon equipped and he, then he's using his race ability. This would actually be very cool because if that happens, Lunarian is going to be the first, ra uh, first race with an attack ability. Most races right now in the game do not have an attack ability and Lunarian might be the first race to have an attack ability if it gets added. However, I'm just saying that but it's most likely going to be a Dragon Fruit rework ability. But which Dragon Fruit rework ability? Before we talk about that, Dragon Fruit rework is actually going to cost 5,000 Robux. It's super expensive. Do you have any Dragon Fruit right now? Do you have any Robux right now? The answer is probably no. So watch this sponsor. Kinjo is an amazing app that ranks the best quality Roblox games. Each game is ranked on a 0 to 5 flame scale based on the learning potential in each game. When you play higher ranked games, you earn Kinjo coins. Earn enough Kinjo coins and redeem them for real life Robux. Make sure to use my referral code K M. 4 D J H when signing up to earn 300 Kinjo coins for free. Once you sign up, share my referral code with your friends so you all get extra Kinjo coins. We will also be doing a permanent fruit giveaway for everyone that uses my referral code when signing up on Kinjo, so don't forget this very important step if you want a free permanent fruit. And yeah, the sponsor of today's video is Kinjo because all you really have to do with Kinjo is download their app, enter my referral code to be entered into my permanent fruit giveaway of uh, your choice, which is probably going to be Dar Dragon Fruit or Kitsune. So enter my referral code, free 300 Kinjo coins, download their app, and play the Robux games you always play to earn Robux for free. 
Currently, it's only available for iOS right now, but it will also be available for Android soon. And like I mentioned, people who use my referral code will be entered into a giveaway. So all you have to do is download this right now and you are going to be able to earn tons of Robux while waiting for the update, which is actually very good. Now, in talking about this, um, which move could this be? So there's actually two moves that I see it being. So number one is going to be Heatwave Beam. I can definitely see it being Heatwave Beam as an inspiration. So for example, um, like a, like a Magic Bus said, that this could have been the inspiration. And it, it does make sense. It does make sense. It could be the inspiration for this, which is pretty cool. However, in my opinion, um, in my opinion, it's a little bit too big like it's literally almost as big as an island this effect is almost as big as an island for it to be the move for, for it to be the heat wave beam i feel like it's way too big for it to be um i feel like it's way too big for it to be just the move of the non-transformed version so if you transform i reckon it could possibly be the the heat wave beam of the transformed dragon it could be the heat wave beam of the transformed dragon which is very cool because if you take a look at it it's actually kind of big it's almost as big as an entire island which is insane because this does also point to the fact that it's probably gonna have a massive hitbox and then this is um a leak apparently now i don't know if this is a youtube leak or if this is a twitter leak most leaks that happen for block suits are on twitter they came from Blo discord and they were sent on twitter and stuff like that and as you guys can see right here um you can see that um there's a dragon right there and this is the tail i believe as well right here this is the dragon head and then this is the effect the attack so according to the guy who sent this to me um this apparently and this is going to be the same so this is him charging the beam ability and then this is him basically using that attack so this is probably going to be um the charging ability while you're using heatwave beam and then this is going to be what's gonna happen um once you finally release the attack so looks pretty good right so while we are at it we are going to take a look at all of the dragon fruit rework leaks right now so the first leak that we've got in the entirety of um the run of dragon fruit is this one and then this is actually the next uh leak so this is dragon or this is fire shower which is this one and by the way just a quick note the reason why i think dragon fruit uh, uh all right so i think what this is is likely um the transform dragon c move so the transform dragon c move will probably leave effects like this in order to make it super in order to make it better because right now the fire shower of the transform dragon is kind of useless because it's super easy to dodge so this is probably an, an attempt to make it better and then this is the c move of the non-transformed version of the dragon fruit rework and then this is the transformation so this is what you look like when transforming so this is currently what i look like when transforming so you can see that they did um put a lot more effort into this effects as well this is basically going to be you transforming and then this is going to be another one of the abilities of dragon fruit but this is going to be the Zay move, the Heatwave Beam. That's pretty much all the leaks we have right now of Dragon Fruit Rework. Um, there's, I think, a little bit more out there that we could maybe find eventually. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Dragon Fruit Rework is going to be releasing hopefully soon. I'm excited for it as well, just about as much as you guys are. And this is our, all the leaks we have right now. And that's going to be it for today's video. Thanks for watching and peace out, everybody.